Hi. I am your Orange TAI support for this week. Today I will share with you the Mobile Analytics Suite sales volume. This dashboard is where you want to go to see the number of private residential sales volume over time. First of all, from the top, we can see the sales types, which are new sale, resale, and sub-sale. And property types, which we have non-landed, landed, and EC. On the second row, we have the time horizon. It allows us to see either the past 12 months data, last 12 quarters data, or last 10 years data. These buttons are filters that we can use to navigate the charts below. Moving forward onto the two bar charts, both show the number of private residential sales, but segmented in two different ways. The first bar chart shows sales segmented into its sales types, meaning new sales, resale, or sub-sale components. With the total number of sales shown in the small black box above. While the second bar chart is segmented into market segment, which we often refer to as core central region, CCR, rest of central region, RCR, and outside central region, OCR. As an example on how to read the first chart, in February 2020, the total number of sales was 1,364, with new sale numbering 961, resale 395, and a very small number of sub-sale. Similarly for the second chart, in February 2020, the total number of sales was still 1,364, with CCR numbering 524, RCR 365, and OCR 475. Next we move to the bottom section of the dashboard. Here it provides a summary over the bar charts above. The pie chart on the left provides the percentages of total sales by market segment. While on the right, total sales volume, highest and lowest transactional volume can be easily identified. If we want to focus only on new sales, we have to unselect resale and sub-sale in the filters above. And the charts and summaries below will reflect our selections. Similarly, if we want to see only landed property type, we have to select landed, then unselect non-landed. The filters turn gray when unselected and orange when we select them. Next, if we want to view a data from a longer time horizon, we can select 12 quarters or 10 years respectively. This sums up the basic introduction and interactions of the dashboard. Thank you. And see you for my next video.